Breaking news out of Plymouth tonight where a car has crashed into a house killing two people, including a child. We're hearing that the mother and one of her children were killed in that rollover accident. Another child seriously injured. Good evening, I'm Ann Nyberg. I'm Erin Logan. Darren has the evening off. This all happened in the Terryville section of Plymouth on South Main Street. Officials say a car rolled over and hit the home in the 100 block. That's where we find News 8's Bob Wilson. He's live with the very latest on this crash. Bob? It was a very, very somber mood here. Matter of fact, we just had three sergeants from the Plymouth Police Department come up and talk to us about the accident. They have called for counseling to be available for their first responders because of the nature of the accident. A mother, two children caught in a rollover car accident that went into a house. The mother, one child, one child was airlifted to Hartford Hospital. That child did not make it. Another child taken by ground ambulance to Waterbury Hospital, we're told. Very serious condition, stable, but very serious. Uh, and the mother did pass away. Now, investigators say everything is on the table. They don't know where they're going with the investigation. They're still in the preliminary stages of it. They're looking at all the factors. They say nothing is leading them down a road just yet. They're going to take it all, look at it all in. Meanwhile, the officer to first arrive on the scene had his hands full and had some help from some passer buyers. The officer that first responded to the scene, there were, there were, there was, uh, the victims were trapped inside the vehicle and they, uh, along with some other people in the area, they helped get them out of the vehicle. Uh, the operator of the vehicle uh, had to be extracted by the fire department. The fire department was at the fire department at the time, just a couple of uh, miles up the road. We're here in about three minutes. Took them, they said, about 15 to 20 minutes to cut the roof off to get the mother out. The two children were handed through a window, handed out, taken to the hospital. And now police are still trying to figure out exactly what went wrong. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live in Plymouth, News 8.